Jesus' name. From verse 1 it says, And Jesus went out and departed from the temple. And his disciples came to him for to show him the buildings of the temple. Verse 2 says, And Jesus said unto them, See, see ye not all these things? Verily I say unto you, there shall not be left here one stone upon another that shall not be thrown down. Verse 3. And as he sat upon the Mount of Olives, the disciples came to him privately. Mm. Saying, tell us. When shall all these things be? When shall these things be? And what shall be the sign of thy coming? Thank you, Lord. Mm. And of the end of the world. I want you to note that. Verse 4. And Jesus answered and said unto them, Take heed that no man deceive you. For many shall come in my name, saying, I'm a, I am Christ, and shall deceive many. And they, ye shall hear of wars and rumors of wars. See that you be not troubled. For all these things must come to pass, but the end is not yet. For nations shall rise against nation. And kingdom against kingdom. And there shall be famines and pestilence and earthquake in diverse places. All this are the beginning of sorrows. This is Jesus' own description of the last days. Now we are looking at surviving these last days. We are the generation that have been called to see the tail end of the last days. You don't need to be confused about it. The Lord Jesus told us clearly that there will be the end of this age. There will be the end of the world. There will be the last day and he gave us the signs. We are looking at surviving in those last days. And I want to begin by explaining to you and establishing the fact that the last day is really coming. There will be a day that will be the last. But there are events that the Lord Jesus has already described to us that will happen before then. There was a day called the first day. And the Bible says, and the evening and the morning was the first day. There will be a day called the last day. And Jesus began to tell his disciples when they asked him questions. You know, they were looking at the magnificent temple 